Hello everybody, today we're doing Shadow's Peak. Now this is a game by the same maker who did the scariest uh, game in the woods I've ever played. And I've played a lot of games, and I'm not kidding you. Uh, it's called Witch Hunt. If you have not seen that one, check that one out too. If you're not sure on it or you're not sold in it, check out my Let's Play if you don't believe me. We're going to go with this one. Um, he does really good optimization, and actually, although you didn't see it on the screen, it actually had uh, a language... Ooh, that might be a little too loud. There is actually a language thing. Selection. So it's... Dark legends surround oh. this place. Let me check. That's why, by offering Michelle to meet here, I've decided to kill two birds with one stone, spend some time with Michelle, and gather some information from my book about myths and legends. The problem I have is that when I'm near Michelle, I completely forget about my work. The hell just happened there? Whoa. Was he dreaming, maybe? Sorry, guys. I didn't mean to talk to you at the start of that. I didn't know we were getting a cutscene there. Very different game, I'll say, right off the bat, than Witch Hunt, from what it looks like. Um, for one thing, I think in this one I am a myth hunter. Sort of a cryptozoologist, if you will. Somebody who studies ancient legends, myths. Now, Birds Falling from the Sky, I will tell you all, is a old Michelle. biblical myth. Michelle! Can I run? Michelle! I can run. Okay, so that's a save point. So we know the red crystal is a save point. Do we have any weapons? But, uh, now you're able to see them. You can't hurt them, but they will try to hurt you. Oh, that's... I don't like that. That's when I press the two, I get that. Alright, so let's try to press one. I get nothing. So, um... I love games that use mouse wheel for items, so I got a little spoiled on that with FPS games, so I'm a fan of that. Um, different terrain as well. Witch Hunt takes place in a forest, and I complimented it on being the best developed forest I've seen in a horror game, and I stick to that. So far, I haven't seen a better one. Not even a certain game with a man who is skinny compared to that. Um, the, the witch hunt just blows that one right out of the water as far as scariness and tension. Now I believe here... Uh, you know one thing I'm gonna say this developer does well that I like is atmosphere. So much of a horror movie a game has to be the atmosphere, and if it's not done right, I mean, look at that. Now, he could have easily cheaped out on us and just had that black underneath there, so you couldn't see the holes in the bridge. It's a small detail, but every de fucking... You kidding me? Damn bird flying out of the... Holy shit, I jumped. I jumped, I'm not even lying. And there is a dog, I'm hoping, that cannot bite me. I'm gonna save it here. We are near a house, I'm hoping we can loot and get a few items. I don't know what to do about that dog. We will try to find another way in, yes. Let's avoid the dog for now, maybe, eh? I've saved my game, though, so let's be a little bold. Nope, let's not be a little bold. That dog is, I don't like that dog growling at all. Oh my god, I was a bit of a chicken there with that. Uh, but I'm not messing with that shit. That dog sounded crazy. Can we go around the back here? Uh huh. Before we go in there, you all know me. I explore everything in the game. 
So we're now at house. So we are in deep country. Maybe Virginia. That keeps coming up and things. Uh, Y'all don't even know. I had never heard that West Virginia song because I'm not a Southern fan uh, until recently. We saw Lucky Logan, and then the new Fallout trailer had it, and then uh, we watched Kingsman Golden Circle, and it was in that, and I thought, gee, three times now that song has came into it. Three asteroids that could really hit Earth and wipe out life. So that is a paper we found up here. Do I have a flashlight by chance? I hit F? No. Can I crouch? I can crouch. Crouching is good. Let's see if there's anything around here. I don't... I don't know if you all can hear it, but there's this kind of tense, uh... I don't even know... Sound? I don't know what else to describe it as, really. Just... Oh, that's never a good sign in a house. That's not going to help the real estate value at all. No, sir, I don't like it. Who was here? Zappa. Is that like who is phone? Or are you... Or is it metaphorical? Who is he? Oh, shit. I'm not paying for that. Just so y'all know. Can anyone hear me? Oh, oh, oh. Please, someone help. Okay. I'm in a cave and my leg is broken. The battery's almost dead. God, can I try to this? We tried an old ritual to create a possessed doll. Instead of a doll, we used a teddy bear. Don't think it worked. Uh, I don't know, but I have a flashlight now, and that's one light more than. And that's a effing heart on a plate. Not loving that. I do wish I could grab the walkie talkie. That would be a neat feature. Oh, and that's a Ouija board. But you see what I'm saying about atmosphere and horror games? Uh, I feel like some occult book that's actually an elder star from Lovecraftian work, I believe. Shit! That teddy bear was not there a second ago. You let me pass, teddy? Uh, and that front door wasn't open either. That also wasn't open. That just busted open there. I'm a dude, I do not. Please don't be something gross. Please don't be something gross. Uh, and of course, it's. Oh, okay. I gotcha. So I can pull it. And maybe we can get this past that dog. You want the bone, doggy? You want the bone? Yeah. I threw the bone. That dog ain't having it. Shit. What do I do now? What do I do now? I have failed at throwing a friggin' bone. Zaffin is a demon of the second order. He is also known as Fire Demon because during a rebellion in heaven he proposes up heaven on fire. So, a bit of a pyromaniac. Um, this looks like necromancy. If we're following real paganism, and this is most certainly necromancy, not normal witchcraft, uh, just so that you all know, do not think this is normal witchcraft. This is clearly necromancy at work here. Um, there's a lot of worship of the dead, etc., etc. I don't know if I want to save my game there with that failed phone throw attempt. We're going to try and circle back around, grab that phone, and then get it to the dog again. Show your shit. Where's the bone? Where is the bone? Where did I throw it? Where the hell did I throw the bone? What is in there? I can't get it, whatever it is. Alright. Help! Where did I throw the bone? There it is, I think. There it is. Okay, good, good, good. Get it. Get the, get the fucking bone, would you? There we go. Get the, you son of a bitch. That dog just is not interested in that bone. It's gotta be for him, though. I don't know. Do I throw it at him? We're gonna try throwing it at him. So far, I've thrown it everywhere but at him. 
Well, okay, I haven't thrown it everywhere. I've thrown it two places, so let's not lie. But, uh, let's try and throw it at the dog. Alright, he winds up for the pitch. He goes in. You dead. Really? Ladies and gentlemen, we're about to be mauled by a dog. Screw it. Let me go. <laughs> Already injured by a dog, because I failed to lure the dog away from the cave. Now, to me, I think I was supposed to throw it away from the dog, but uh, probably closer, like at a pivotal moment, and I did not. I don't know if my health will regenerate. In the other game, the health regenerated. This dude, I do not like that teddy bear. They try to make it possessed, and clearly it worked. Telling me that didn't work. What the hell's that then? Why is it there? This is not Teddy Ruxpin, and what in the hell was that? Oh, can I grab you now? It's warm. Weird. Knock the teddy down. Out of my way, Ruxpin. You got shit to do. Uh, let's see here. This is, uh... Oh, lordy. I am, uh... I'm certainly... Certainly not loving that. It's blood there. That's always a is there a trail. The guy said he broke his leg. Maybe I can help him. Maybe he's in here. Is what I'm hoping. Is that if we follow enough, we will find a live human in here. And if he is dead, then I'm hoping that we find something an item something vital to our survival here that we could take and use. Because as most of you know in horror games, there are two types of people. You and uh, the dead. Normally the deads are basically for looting. So I don't... Oh, Jesus H, I do not like that shit at all. No, 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 no. Nope. Don't give a shit what that is. We're not going near it. Screaming, throwing, I don't know. That was craziness. Oh boy. There's Teddy Rocks. You know what I don't like, people? Is I think I have to go near that screaming ladder. Another sentence you don't think you'll say in a day. You should really, I should do some type of montage, but I suck at video editing. So if any of you do good video montages, make a montage of me saying things you don't think you'll say in a day. And uh, I'll give you credit and feature it on the channel. How's that? Um, eventually, we will get better. We've even talked about having a title screen or some fancy little, like, infographic. One reason I don't do that is because, to me, I'd rather just jump right into the Let's Play. Um, what are you guys' thoughts about on that? Let me know in the comments. Also, uh, what do you think of the game so far? you guys like it? Is it spooky dooky? Does it remind you guys of any other games? Um, what would you have done different on your play compared to my playthrough of it? I'm curious to see opinions and maybe pointers. If you do have this one, let me know your tips. I tend to stay off spoilers and stuff like that while I play these. Now the bats there are a nice touch, I like that, because they, uh, they just about made me jump. I was already bracing for something though, so that time he didn't get me. But uh, you see what I mean about the atmosphere, this game just has... Again, the cave feels huge, all of this feels, and that... 
I obviously cannot cross that. Can I? I don't want to try and cross that. We'll put it that way. No, I cannot. That's collapse there. Um, but again, you see what I mean. This is smart level design. This is smart... Not level design, but you guys get what I mean. This is smart design for a game. Um, and his game, Witch Hunt, he does the same thing where it's very intelligent. Um, you feel like there's lots to do, lots to see. I feel like this cave is nice and big. I don't feel like I've been cheaped out. And you all know what I'm talking about in some games, where it's like, oh, you can go two ways. No, you can only go one way. And you know what I'm talking about with that. I don't catch him pair traps, he said. I will agree. I can't believe that one got me, but I wasn't even looking down, so that's really my own problem. Oh, that's the stuff. Can I reset that, or is it stuck? I think that's just stuck. Alright. Well, that, that was a, uh, that was a gentle reminder to watch my ass in this game. That's creepy. That looks like a children's, uh, backpack. And that is a doll. What would a creepy game be without a baby doll to make me shit my pants? Let me ask you. Oh boy, that's uh... That's not good. So we went up the stairs there. Let's try going this way and see if this way leads to unless this way just leads back out. Which it might. Dude, I do not. My heart is beating so fast right now. I'm not even gonna lie to you all. My heart is really beating fast. His uh, other game did this to me too. Where it's, it's, I'm telling you, you guys haven't. This is Shadow's Peak. You're gonna want to check this one out if you like horror. Um, two recommendations from me from one developer. That's pretty rare. But uh, I like the way this guy does his stuff. I like how big, how detailed the cave looks. I like that right off the bat, you're given a little info and dropped right into the game. This doesn't hold your hand at all. Fuck. I really don't think I can do this. But God, dude. Now he's got me looking up even. What is the worst that happens if I... If I fall in that water... Do I see anything else down there? Looks like it could go that way. Maybe that way. I'm not loving this idea at all. I'm obviously not gonna make that jump. We're gonna try and sprint and jump it. Oh god, no! Shit! Okay, well, it's so much for that. I don't see any monsters down in the water. I survived the fall, at least. I'm hoping I'm not trapped in the game now, because that would be very boring for all of you to see, I'm sure. Then again, maybe there is something down there that I should be messing with that I'm not, so maybe we can see. Oh, can I climb the vines? I can climb the vines, okay. Alright, so there's a way. Clearly the teddy is important in this game. Um, also clearly, we need to make sure when we're dealing with this game to not just ignore... We can see a path we should... We're gonna try and barrel through. So if we see a path, we're just gonna try and take the path. Even if it seems like we can't. Uh, from now on, we're just gonna try it anyway, because why not? Um, there's a lot, actually, that I, I personally like that's been going on here. Ooh. Can I really see the spirits of the dead now, or am I just losing my mind? Maybe both? Oh, shit. I don't, I don't like that. That's probably... Oh, God. There they are. There they are. Creepy. Why am I getting closer? What's wrong with me? Let's, uh, let's not do that once I got to... So maybe we'll have to come back to this room. Let's avoid this room for now. Um, 
Skulls on coals, always great the end game, so I don't care who we are. Dude. Looks like I need to find fire. Oh, of course I do. Hey. I wonder if that bear would work. He is hot. It doesn't seem like I can touch him for long. Cut your ups in there. Maybe I can find a light or something. Jesus. The nerves, I'm telling you. The nerves. In my heart right now must sound like thunder uh, in my chest because it is beating so hard. And the bear is nothing. Come on, are you kidding me? Ah, you little son of a bitch. Alright. We're gonna try to do this again. Let's see if we can... Get on over here. Oh, sorry. I really feel like, obviously, I need to go this way. Um, but falling down there is not ideal. But I don't see any other way, and I don't have any other means of fire, do I? It looks, though, like I can climb back up later, because I see a vine there. So, yeah, we're going to take the vine. Take the vine. Take the knee. As Dr. Hughes says, Geronimo. Now, what is this crystal? Anything? I can't save it there. It's been a while since I have saved it. We're gonna look for fire and we'll climb back up there. Um, it's ironic because I'm now doing the thing I said I was going to do, but I did not want to do originally, which is the barrel creepers. I hope that all made sense to you. Oh, no, 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 God, can I, oh, Jesus, okay, so that hurts, that hurts every time I see one of them, but there's something there, but a weird skull, damn it, that's nothing I can use, I made a horrible decision by coming down here. Please don't be another creature, because I don't think I can survive another hit. That was a pretty heavy one. Yes, clearly you might have lighter, some lighting up there. Yes, perfect. That's actually a really nice uh, leather satchel there. Indiana Jones would be very proud. Also, I don't know if we're looking at a mummified body, I guess they have a statue. I'm gonna go ahead and just say, for the sake of the game of spookiness, that is actually a long mummified body. It might be a statue. I don't know. If it is, uh, it's so freaky as shit, so it doesn't matter. Also, now we know uh, when we run from spirits to haul ass because they don't play around. I do not like that dome because I feel like that's just a nice way of saying it's your ass. So. Okay, run, 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 run back. Please run back. Did I light it? Watch, I die. Oh 
Oh shit. Now I let it. Let it. Now I let it. Run back. Run back. Run back. Run back. Oh boy. Well, that was actually pretty tense. That, uh. Yes, finally see the spot. Okay, I was testing a theory to see if those healed me any, but they do not, because I had not paid attention, because frankly, I was scared shitless. I'm not afraid to admit that. Um, like I said, our channel I wanted to do, because I don't like. And again, no offense to the YouTubers, but I, I don't like to overreact on our channels. So if you see a reaction from me and I'm scared, it is quite genuine, I will tell you that. And again, I'm not trying to knock other YouTubers. I know some of them make a living by overreacting and doing, you know, silly things, all that, and all this stuff. I just, I don't know. I'm not that person. I don't want to be that person. And uh, I feel like that's not for everybody, so I try to do my own thing with it. Now, I went here first because it looked like there was maybe something to find in here, but I don't know. I do love the, the lighting in this game, though. Um, that's one other thing I wanted to say that this developer, I feel, handles well, is his use of lighting. I don't like whatever that noise was. Dude, I'm getting... A little tense here, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, just atmospheric horror gets me. Um, again, I think it's funny because, you know, people are probably laughing at me right now, but uh, don't, don't do that. That's not nice. Uh, but do if you want, I guess. I don't know. But no, atmospheric horror to me is always scarier than just jump scare, and this has a lot of build up. Now I need to check real quick. Alright, to my time. I multitask usually, so I like to make sure I know what I'm doing. Mm. Holy shit. That generally scared me. We need fresh shells. Kill them, and you'll get your fiance back. What? I don't have any. How do I kill them? I don't have any, uh. I don't have any weapon. Relax, everybody. Even the dog on my lap right now is freaking out. He's having little puppy dreams where he's whooping. I don't know if you can hear him or not. If you can, though, can you hear him? Listen. Can you hear him? That is our, our resident dog. Who actually, I think, was in my lap in the last one, too. Oh, my God. I'm not going to lie. I thought I was dead there. Please don't kill me. You did not kill me. Okay. What do you have? Do you have a weapon? There's a note inside. I saw a girl shoot a guy to death. I decided to wait and hit out in the cave, but I stepped in a bear trap. I hope you're not reading this because I didn't mention it. Well, thank you, sir. And there's a bear trap. This must be the guy that radios us earlier, I'm guessing. So that tied that in nicely. And we saw his soul leave his body. So that was pretty creepy. If I try this again. No, let us get the same thing right up. Hoping to see if maybe I could try to loot it. It just looks like looks like it's broken, okay. I thought I heard a noise there, like a voice or something. That was really weird. Can I take the lantern, please? I know I already have one light, but I feel even better with two. Uh, and you don't go anywhere, do you? No. Right. I wonder if I can... Can I let you on fire? No. This, I feel like that's important somehow. Let's come back to that. We're gonna go the way we can go. Um, yeah, that text messaging made me jump. I'm not lying to you. Out of all of it so far, uh, this one, to contrast compare a little, 
a little more walky, but also very atmosphere heavy. Um, fire demon? Oh shit, 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 shit. Why did I just stand there? Why did I- oh shit, he's coming, he's coming. Why did I just stand there? Why did I just stand there? No, no, fuck you, Teddy Ruxpin. You're not getting me. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Now I know what to do. Aha! Told you all that would come in handy. Shit. I died. I died. Alright. So now I know what to do. It's a matter of getting Teddy Ruxpin to chase me. Get him there. So let's just rush forward into here. See the Ruxpin. And then run my tail. Is there a dodge? can't go anywhere else except for back in here. So I basically have to let this little rock and roll up, roll around, and try to avoid them. Come on! Burn! More! Burn, burn out of the way more. Shit. He's still right there. Okay. Can I do it? We're trying, we're trying! Come on, God, run! Run, 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 run! What is there? Shit, there's nothing there I can get. Oh my god, I'm freaking out. Run, run. Come on, we can do this. We can do this. We can do this. Where is he? Where is he? Come on, you little son of a bitch. Why is that taking so long to go? I mean, right? Let's get it. Good. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Water. Oh my god. God. Oh god. I mean, he's gotta die when he gets the water, right? Yes, alright. Oh. Alright. Alright, game dev. Good puzzle. Good puzzle. Interesting puzzle, that's for sure. So, where. Uh, why did I come. Let's go back on land for a minute. It wasn't that hard, was it? Just a couple more. Okay, so those are the souls I have to kill. I knew such shit was hard. Jesus. That thing almost handed me my ass. Some healing something would be lovely. But I don't suppose I get any of that. No. Um, well, I'll give the game credit on a few levels. One, it does not hold your hand. In the description it said it did not hold your hand. They're not kidding. It does not hold your hand. I don't know if I want to save it here with only having 34 health, but I suppose if I replay it and want to be cheap, I could just wait until my health goes up. Right now we're going to keep moving and exploring for the sake of the let's play and excitement. We got some Adrenaline glowing, glowing, going. Nope, 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 nope. Shit. Son of a bitch. Alright, well, that's gonna do it for me. The game itself is Shadow's Peak. Uh, I don't even think I'm like a tenth of the way through this game. This is just the beginning. Uh, I'm Bones. Uh, let me grab the pup here. He'll be super happy. This here is little boy. I say hi, little boy. Hello. Make sure you put a like, make sure you uh, subscribe if you haven't already, check out our other videos, and we will uh, be back with more. So thank you guys very much for watching, and enjoy your day.